Welcome back to the studio. Today is Monday, October 10th, and I am planning on taking you along on this very busy week of my life. I have my big shop update, the last one of the year, happening this Saturday, October 15th, where I'm launching a lot of new autumnal themed and inspired products as well as all of my winter products, winter prints, all of my holiday and winter cards, um, my 2023 calendar which so many people have asked about and are super excited to get this year as well as um, a new product which I'm super excited about is I made wooden ornaments this year with some of my little animal characters. They're really cute and turned out so well. I'm really excited to release those as well. So, big update happening, which means a lot of prep work needs to happen this week. The ornaments, um, I don't know how the process works with printing the art onto the cut pieces of wood, but there's this paper on both sides of each that I need to peel off of every single individual ornament, <laughs> as well as tie on the thread and string that I bought to make the little hoop for hanging them on a Christmas tree or wherever you'd like to hang them if you buy one. So I have to do that this week, which will be time consuming, <laughs> as well as I have a lot of new cards and a restock of cards and I have to wrap all of those note card sets in this um, handmade flower paper or floral seed paper that I buy. So I have to cut all the strips of those and wrap all of the note card sets and I have to do some final inventory as well as I'm, I'm also updating and refreshing my website just to give it a new life as I haven't really done anything to it since I first launched my website uh, almost three years ago. So I've just been really, really wanting to give it a good refresh. I also am participating in Inktober this month, so I've been trying to get ahead with my painting so that I'm not painting every single day and I can have some buffer days if needed, but I've caught up to my the point of buffer days I've already made, so I really need to paint a lot of Inktober prompts this week. Like today I'm planning on painting at least three if I can. So that's probably one of the biggest things that I need to do today. And then I just need to start working on crossing off some of these shop update to-dos. I have a list. It's way too long. <laughs> My ever-growing to-do list that I need to do this week before 
Friday specifically. So this is probably going to be quite the long video. A lot of you have been asking for a longer video, so hopefully this will be enjoyable. I'll be taking you along on as much as I can. I'll probably need to stop filming early Thursday so that I can finish editing, upload it to YouTube so I can premiere it on Friday for you guys. But So I hope you guys will enjoy this little peek into my work week and everything that goes on in the full-time life of a artist and content creator. I just feel like I'm juggling so many things right now. All good things, all good things, but it does feel a little overwhelming. But once this week is over, I feel like I'll be feeling pretty good once the shop update is live and all I really need to focus on is just packaging all your orders. So anyway, we have so much to do, we really need to get started. So <laughs> let us stop the chatting and let us get to work.
now Wednesday and I am slowly but surely getting things done but I thought I would pop on here and update you on the stuff that I have done so far so I was able to get a good chunk of the ornaments done I was able to get the alphabet cards done and I've been able to paint five inktober paintings so far Here's the five that I've been able to get done. I'll show, I'll show you a little close-ups of them. Um, but so far, I'm actually been pretty happy with how my little paintings have been turning out, and I'm hoping to sell all the originals once all 31 are done. Do a little 
yeah, original sale, and then I want to make a little zine of all 31 paintings as well. Uh, I've seen some artists do that before, and I've always loved the idea, but like I've said, I've never been able to complete an Inktober challenge, so I thought that that would be a fun little thing to where you guys could have a little booklet of 31 autumn-themed paintings, so... I'm getting excited about that, but so far, I guess I'm just not realizing. Halfway done, I've painted 15 paintings so far. 16 more to go. <laughs> so I'm doing well, keeping on track for that. I'll probably need to paint three more this week. Today, I really need to focus on the card sets. I really need to start cutting up the strips of the flower seed paper and wrapping all the sets that don't have it yet. As well as, let's see, of my list. I need to take product photos of the new products that I have and add that to my website. I also just need to work on website stuff. There's, I'm like I said, I'm refreshing and updating the website, so I still have some details that I need to work through and edit, and just make sure things are organized and in the correct places. And then. Once evening comes around, I'm going to start editing this video, editing the first three days, and then uh, so that I can film a little bit tomorrow and then finish editing, export, and upload the video so it's ready to premiere on Friday. Man, so many things to do, but we will get them done and we need to get started <laughs> today. So let us first get started on these card sets.
friends. It is now Thursday afternoon. This morning I went on a lovely and refreshing walk with Cedar and then spent the majority of the morning cleaning and organizing the studio because it just was a mess after all the stuff I've been working on this week. And I just wanted to reorganize some of the product and make room for some of the new product. So I did all that. And now the space feels nice and clean and refreshed and I feel ready for the <laughs> for making more of a mess when I start packing all of your orders. But it is now crunch time for me. I need to finish editing this video. I did the majority of it last night, but I need to edit everything I filmed today and get that exporting and uploaded to YouTube so it's ready for tomorrow. And then basically all I have left on my to-do list is a bunch of computer work. I still have a lot of details that I need to fix and clean up on the website just to make sure that is all good to go for tomorrow. My patrons have an early access to the shop update tomorrow on Friday at 12 p.m., which will be shortly after this video premiere, which is really exciting. And then the shop update will be open to the public, everyone else, on Saturday, October 15th at 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So I'm really excited to share everything with you. Um, I'm looking forward to what happens after the update, but thank you in advance to everyone who chooses to buy something from the autumn and winter update. Uh, it really means so much to me and it's just such a big support. And also, just thank you so much for being here and for watching today's video. I know it was a little bit of a long one, but I hope you enjoyed. So, I wish you all a magical week ahead, and I will see you next week for another video.